sorry about the interference. We've got no idea what's going on. Join. Um, We've been streaming on TikTok still, so everyone on TikTok will be able to see. This is our streaming technology, etc. Everyone on TikTok. I'm just waiting for people to join again on the new live, and then we'll be all good. It's a pain. I don't know why it does know. that. It just goes glitchy after a while. It is annoying. Are we back, guys? We're we back in the room. Is everybody happy? Is it still the glitching? New, the new uh, QRs into this new live. Yeah, we've got 160 people and 192 now. 225. 245. 276. It's going up. It's going up. Is Sydney sold out yet? Not sure on that one. 349 years. I'll wait until it goes because there was a lot of people on that live. Yeah, we'll wait till everybody's back with us. There was about a thousand people watching on FB. Has the um, JD voucher one been yet? One yet? I don't think we've done a JD one, did we? Not tonight. Everybody's anyway. saying that's much better, much better. Yeah, sorry guys. Honestly, it's annoying for us as well. Uh, obviously, we want it to be crystal clear all the time, but it's just the internet, unfortunately, up here. Right, there's 500 of these on now. So. We're going to be doing the bike. <laughs> Chloe called it steak and banana day yesterday. <laughs> We're on the 2013 GSXR 750. Uh, there's a £4,800 cash alternative on this bike. It was £2.50 to enter. It's got 16,602 miles on it. Uh, so there's loads of stuff on it. I have never, I'm not into bikes. have no idea about it. It's a cool, cool bike. They it's look a, cool. It's a really good bike. <laughs> uh, it came from Granite Moto, which is uh, Craig Sherlock's new company. If you want to buy any top class bikes, ranging from sensible bikes to high performance, head better. to head to Granite Moto, uh, Craig Sherlock's new business. Yes, Mike, the electric bike has been drawn. My fave bike, but probably end up wrapped around a tree. <laughs> right, here we go, guys. You ready? Can everyone give us some hell yes? Let's go. Hell yes on FB, YouTube, and on TikTok, please. Mm -hmm. Comment. Hell yeah. Get with it, guys. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. We're about That's to draw the bike. Razor. We can send folk to the moon, but rural internet is still <laughs> Exactly. Come on. Let's do it. Loves likes hell yes. Everyone's doing it. Let's go. The winner of the 2013 GSXR is 373. 373. Nice and low there, guys. Someone should have phoned me. I presume it's probably going to be a winner for me back. It will be, it'll be. What did we draw last? The golf? Should we answer? Oh, hold on. 373. 373. We've got Stephen Ogg. Stephen Ogg, well done, but we're going to answer this phone call when Leanne gets a chance it could be the was it cami that won the golf cami but we also tried to phone louis as well okay we'll we'll ring that number back uh i think it was cami okay this was cami the, the golfing uh, package winner hello hi is it cami yeah it is it's the annie calvin at bounty competitions are you watching the live no i'm not actually that's okay where are you from Inch. Inch, fantastic. Do you like a bit of golf? I do. Well, you've went and won yourself that fantastic Captain's Cup at to Glen Eagles for three. Oh, lovely. <laughs> Congratulations. You'd be rubbing shoulders with all the celebrities, Steve. Oh, no, it's not Steve. Who is it? It's uh, Cammy. Cammy, sorry. We've, we've just drew a, a draw there. It's Stephen on that one. Cammy, you've just went and won that, mate. You'll be up there with Ronan Keaton and the likes of. Thank you very much. Well Not done. a problem. Congratulations. One of the team will get in touch with you tomorrow and we'll get that organised for you. Great. Thank you very much. Thanks, Cammy. Well See done. Soon. Thank you. Bye. There we go. Happy so days. I call them Stephen because I'm looking at Stephen Ogg's name. That's just one. Stephen Ogg won the motorbike. Uh, even full fibre uh, doesn't work out here yet. It's, it's honestly. We've had like so many we've, different We've internets. had Sky. <laughs> we've had BT. We've tried O2. We, we even tried 4G masks that cost about five grand, which are non-existent now. Um, we had to get them taken down because they were just rubbish. And then the best one out, a lot of them, if you live in a rural area, is Starlink. So this is the best internet that we've got in our area. Yes, Stephen Ogg. So, yeah, it's okay, so... Uh, no, Charlie, I don't like the JD voucher. It's tonight. If we have, we've got a JD voucher. We must do. There must be a JD voucher on. I haven't even seen it. The mobile number you called is currently unavailable. Oh, he's either on the phone or he's busy. I'll try again. If not, we'll try WhatsApp. Oh, oh it's ringing. Hello? 
Hello. Hi, is that Stephen? Yes. It's the Anna Calvin at Bounty Competitions. Are you watching the live? Am I watching live? Yeah, it's Leanne and Calvin at Bounty. What? <laughs> it's Leanne and Calvin at Bounty Competitions. Oh, all right. Aye. <laughs> Where are you from? I'm your neighbour. You're our neighbour? I'm one of your neighbours, eh? Well, you've went and won yourself a 2013 GSX R750. You fucking dancer. <laughs> <laughs> Where, whereabouts do you live, live Steve, in, in curiosity? What direction are you in? <laughs> That's just brilliant. Are you, are you Cumminston way? Are you going into Turriff way? What, what way do you live? Um, just, if you turn in past your house and you go down the bottom of the hill, I'm at the, I'm at the bottom of the hill. Jesus. Well, that's lovely for dropping off that bike to you. Uh, oh, you can, <laughs> you can come and pick it up, man. I can't ride motorbikes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, me, me, me. Happy man. days, Paul. I, I can see you put your entry on on the 9th um, at, at 10.15 in the morning, so well done. <laughs> it's spot on, dude. Happy days. Get so in there. You do have the choice between the GSXR 750 or there's a £4,800 cash alternative, but I can leave you to think about it overnight if you want. Uh, I'll have a think about it and see if I've got a What's another one to the collection? <laughs> you, you can come up and see it as well if you want tomorrow, mate. If you're not too far away, you can pop up and come and see it. I'm on the tea first thing tomorrow. It'll be in the afternoon. Aye, no worries, pal. Just pop in by. Thanks, Thanks Stephen. Thank you, Thank you. Well yeah. done. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs> Happy days. That's crazy, isn't it? I know. Stephen Augie says he literally lives down the... They've got a big long straight outside of our house and he lives at the bottom of that. That's insane. Well done. We're dropping it down to zeros. Um, there is 1.2k of you watching on uh, FB and YouTube. There's actually 1.3 on because we've got YouTube connected up on streaming as well. I'm going to give you the QR codes again just in case you've just joined the live. Uh, over on that stream, we've got 117 years on uh, TikTok. So this is the link for the Bounty's Big One Million. Head over to bountycompetitions.co.uk or onto your app. Get yourself your entry at £10. There are still thousands of entries remaining. It is timer ending for next week on Friday, so a week today. But I think we'll see it drawn sooner. If it magically sells out before 11 p.m. tonight, we will draw it tonight. <laughs> a few people are having a laugh. Sean, Sean says, one way to keep the neighbours happy. Hey, at least if I hear a motorbike screaming past my house, they can't tell me off for test driving the supercars down that way, right? Uh, now that's what they call a local witness. It's Duncan, it's crazy, that, isn't it? We've also got the Sydney holiday for two. If it sells out tonight, we'll draw it tonight. It's £1.50 in entry. There was not many entries left on that one. And the Audi R8 as well. There's £5,000 cash with the car or £40,000 cash alternative. Get your entry on that. So, next one. Taylor says, R8 dream car coming home to its uncle CT. <laughs> good luck, good luck, pal. Thank um, you for all the follows on TikTok. It'd be great if we guys. could sell out the million tonight. So I seen was it? I can't remember the name. Uh, a lady said it's a shame it didn't sell out, but we we have been saying if it sells out, guys, we didn't say that the timer is ending tonight. Just so that you know, um, it, the timer was always set to next week, but we just kept saying if it sells out, we'll draw it. But it's, it doesn't look likely for tonight. Well, anything could happen. Could be drawn tomorrow. Could be drawn Sunday. It's it, you just don't know. Yeah. it could sell out by eleven o'clock tonight if something magical happens. Sharon, Everyone's just sat down with a cup up on the sofa. Sharon says no sound complaints if you keep the neighbours happy. Exactly. If he flies past my house on that bike, then I'm allowed to fly past this in a Lambo when <laughs> we do our next Lambo. <laughs> right. Are we ready for ten thousand pounds? Can I get comments of hell yeah, please? Everybody in the comments, give me some hell yeahs. Give me some loves as well. If you're on TikTok, you just have to tap your screen. If you're over on FB, give us a wee love heart as That's well. nice, Mark. True. It's a nice way to meet your neighbour, exactly. I didn't even know there was many houses down that way, to be honest. Uh, hell of a good night. Yeah, says Sean. Everyone's when can we that, buy yeah. Big G's gym? Great idea. Give a bottle of bigger wins, says James. That's it. Everybody's flooding us with hell okay. yeah. So let's go. The winner of £10,000 tonight is 2095. Well done. 
Congratulations, 2095. Good luck, Siobhan. Right. TikTok always does that. It wants you to always do this puzzle piece. <laughs> 2095. I think it's just to make sure like you're still awake. <laughs> Good luck, Stephen. Plenty of cars getting drawn tonight. They are eight to take one. Namidia Klutwick. There we go. <laughs> well done. <laughs> I told you not to get your clue. Oh, <laughs> just <laughs> you stop get it. Your wig out. <laughs> you Sorry. know what we used to call our son and didn't realize what it meant? I'm not even going to tell you the meaning. We used to call our son. Fishwick, and I don't know why. It's because when he was a baby, don't all babies have a soft head? And his head used to like what? What do you call it? Pulsate on the top. Yeah, because it's soft. Like right, because it's a soft head. Like I guess what was what would that be? His well, veins and stuff. And I used to call him fish. He looks like a wee fish. So I was like Fishwick. We'll call him. And it turns out that's a use. Yes. C a m p o n. <laughs> if you want to know, go and Google it. Yeah, I actually for over a year we were calling our son. <laughs> Like nicknamed it, oh, we fish with, and then uh, <laughs> I says to Calvin, I wonder if that actually means anything. And right enough, yes, yeah. it does mean something on I Google. Use T A M P O N. So we stopped calling that after we found out. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Calvin. I'm going to start calling him again when he's 18 when he annoys me. Shut up, fish with. <laughs> Namibia. Namibia. I think so. Welcome to the Tesco. We'll go again. I'd like this we haven't the drawn media. the take one yet, guys. It is coming up very soon. We've got people asking. Uh, Boulder Heat was one of my <laughs> twin names as it was massive. Jesus. <laughs> Had the horns in the scan photo too. Answers I hate when they don't answer. It's always good to get the winner's phone call, obviously. It's, it's great to hear the reaction. But of, of course, we, we know everybody's you know busy and stuff. Or well, could be on Welcome. a night out. At right, work, you can't get asleep. a hold of Namidia, but actually on the back end it's Nikisha. Okay. Try it again. One more time. One, one more time. If everyone on this live buys an entry, it would sell out quicker, so it would be drawn quicker. Says John, is that for the one mil? Just googled it for Kobe. <laughs> My brother was nicknamed Dusty Bin. <laughs> My nickname at school was Goose, believe it or not, because I was da proper daft. I was used to run around like, like a back. goose. Like a goose, yeah. Welcome. Mine to was that. Chin. And there was no funny meaning behind it, just that I had a big chin because I was so skinny. My chin used to point out. Good luck, Moira. You've still got a few chances left to win if you've entered on the other one, so good luck. Uh, Namidia didn't answer there. Um, so we move on. Don't worry if you knew around here that, that was the winner. Simple as that. <laughs> Leslie said my nickname was Wurzel. <laughs> oh. Brilliant. But I can't read that, Debbie. Oh, I can I? see why, Debbie. Debbie I don't know. Name, nickname was Debbie C O N D O M. <laughs> I wonder where they got that from. Right, 15k we are looking for. We're about to make someone 15,000 pound richer. So, best Ella of says, I don't believe you ever ran about daft Calvin. <laughs> <laughs> I've always been hyper, hyperactive, always since just like Kobe. We always say, Where does Kobe get all his energy from? After all, I am his dad, so I'll lie up. TikTok says, Mine used to be tomato, hashtag red face. <laughs> <laughs> We and, are on and says we call our grandson we D I C K. His name is Richard. <laughs> I like that one, Anne. I think it is. It is indeed. Can we get some hell yes for fifteen thousand pounds? You know I'm going to ask you for hell yes in the comments and loves because mm -hmm. it's the big eens. It if you're is. new here, we do this on all the big competitions at the very end where I want everybody to join in. And it's like we all go, whoa, hell yeah, whoa. Yeah. And then <laughs> and we get a winner. Yeah. 
it's the magic words hell yeah also means clear and good to go as it well it, it's just a bit of fun we've always said it since the beginning so let's go the winner of fifteen thousand pounds for 89p oh boy one of this <laughs> 10591. Well done. 10591 has just won 15,000 pounds. It's a Calvin thing being hyper. My son never stops, but then again, that's the ADHD. Exactly. That's what I've got as well. It's a uh, mix of special. 10591. 10591. 10591. Jesus. Ian. Ian Lennon. Lennon. We've seen his name before. I'll never forget. Years ago. If it was the same Ian Lemon, if it is the same Ian Lemon, he won a, a log cabin from us down in Bankery, and he's never won since, three has he? Three years ago. About three years ago. It was the first ever log cabin that we ever done. You'll you find to remember because he was well up for doing a live, and he was like, hell yeah. He was like dead energetic. If it's the same Ian Lemon, well done to Ian Lemon. If it is you, we're going to ring you. Can anybody else remember that? Have you been with us long enough to remember Ian Lemon? He was a good character, actually. It must be three years ago. Yeah, I would say. done that. Absolutely fantastic. I remember that I think log still was got that log cabin. Said, Steve. I don't know if he still got it or not, but I, I believe he still got it. I never heard if he sold it or not. Uh, one, zero, five. Nine, one, says, yep. <laughs> yes, says Brady. See, people remember. I recognize the name from here, says Ashley. We've got some memories, says Nicola. This was when every single winner we used Sorry, to go and see. Ah, Ian, come on. Uh, remember you going out there when he won? It was great. Sorry, this person. We'll try and ring him on WhatsApp. If I remember rightly, he's a fisherman, isn't he? So he might be out at sea. Um, I do, I remember because um, this was at the point where we literally would be out every single day seeing every single winner. Now it's not possible because we get that many. Cheers, Anne Marie. <laughs> Brian says there was a guy called Cunningham at his work called Sly Bacon, was his nickname. <laughs> He'll be at sea today, I mean. We can't get him on WhatsApp. No. We'll just send him a message because it. I mean, he could be on night shift, or well, if he's on night shift, he would answer. But you know what I mean. Could have been working all all night and then sleeping. Catch him fash. <laughs> Catch him fash. Fash. <laughs> no answer, guys. And funnily enough, he didn't answer when he won the long cabin all them years ago. You remember? He's a hard I'm sure it was his wife that we managed to speak to. I think We did, Ella. Yes, we delivered all the prizes. I'm not joking, yeah? Remember, we had to get babysitters because we had that little caddy van. Mm -hmm. And we used to go out at uh, 7 in the morning, some mornings. We didn't get in until 11 o'clock at night. And that was in between the draw days. Remember yeah. them days? I don't know how we done it, honestly, without a team. That's and then, how we aged ourselves. Yeah, honestly, we weren't in the house and it was exhausting. Uh, but we used to go and see every single winner for the first couple of years, I would say. Yeah. Uh, but still now, we, we we deliver the cars personally. Uh, or, or we have a lot of winners now that come to Bounty HQ. <laughs> um, but unfortunately, uh, a lot of people were refusing winners' pitches because Brett was our new delivery driver. Uh, but of course, we're not going to say, sorry, Brett, there's no job for you. So we made a job for him in the office. But because there was that many people refusing winners' pitches, we just didn't see the point having the van anymore. There was no point personally getting Brett to personally deliver the prizes. So we just send everything out now, don't we? We do. It's uh, pointless can't to see people if they don't want the winner's picture. <laughs> right. Everyone's going to be really wanting to know if they've won this. So it's the Mini Cooper S Sport 5-door cash alternative. It's £13,000. Sharon says, I bet you they were the best days. So uh, we used to love going to see all the winners. It was great. Best part of the job. It right. was fantastic. Here we go. This was 99p to enter. It's a 2020 with 34,000 miles. Two liter Cooper S Sport Sol Solaris Orange Metallic. It's a really nice color. It almost mm. looks red in the pictures, but it is more orange. Uh, beautiful car, loads of optional extras on it. One to 27,000. So here we go. Good luck, Don. I remember when all the prizes were all like Nintendo Switches. <laughs> we used to do a lot of them. Here we go, right. Again, guys, you know what to do. 
Hell yes in the comments. Love the lives and let's get a winner for the Mini Cooper S Good luck or to Stephen Lad, Stephen Pugh. The cash alternative of thirteen thousand pounds. Good luck, everybody. What a big night it's been tonight, isn't it? It's Fingers really crossed for you all. We've still got the Volkswagen Tigman and the Audi R8 to do as well. Everyone shouting hell yeah on all different platforms. So let's go. The winner of the Mini Cooper S is 2565. 2565, well done. You've just went and won a Mini. Lorna says you personally delivered a Father's Day bundle to me and I wasn't in. You'd have, you had to leave it in my shed. <laughs> We had a lot of that as well. We had a lot of that as well, but that's that's two, just life, isn't it? Two, five, six, five, two, five, six, five. We've got Karen Scott Scroggy. 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 Yeah, Karen Scroggy. Yeah. Well done. Two, five, six, five. I mean, as you can tell, if you haven't been with us for a while, I'm really bad at pronouncing <laughs> things. Did you guys manage to get some Scotland tickets for the Euros in Germany? I haven't yet. We haven't managed to get any yet. I believe now you're talking stupid money, 10, 10 grand plus, I think now. Yeah. But we'll try. We'll try. We've done stranger things. We've definitely got the right people in the right places to ask them kind of questions. Here we go. Right. Finding the winner's phone number for this one. Sounds good to me, James. A 90s hot hatch. <laughs> Well no, done, says Stephen. Don't even. I know. Don't ask me to buy um, any more old school because I'll buy them all. <laughs> Two, five, six, five. Cheers, Alice. It has been a huge night of draws. Come on, guys. <laughs> Hello, is that Karen? Yes. It's Leanne and Calvin at Bounty Competitions. Are you watching the live? No. No, that's You're all. <laughs> Where are you from? Stonehaven. Lovely. Well, you have went and won yourself that lovely orange Mini Cooper S Sport. Oh my God, you're joking. I'm not joking. Congratulations. Oh my God, I got the Mini. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Karen. What a win! <laughs> well done. Did you really want the car? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I can't believe this. I can't believe this. Oh my God. <laughs> Shocking. <laughs> Well, well done, Karen. You're on a night out tonight, are you? I know. <laughs> well, it looks like you'll be celebrating even more then. Oh, God. Thank you very much. You're very welcome, Karen. Now, Leanne's got a question for you, but you can have overnight to think about it. So, you've got the choice between the Mini Cooper S or there's a £13,000 cash alternative, but you can have a think about it if you need to. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll... I'm shocked. I think I'm taking the car because we did speak, my husband did speak about this before. Wow. So you want to take the car? We can so we'll take it that you want the car, but what we'll do is we could give you to tomorrow so you can speak to your husband and then we yep. can we'll phone you tomorrow. Okay. I hope you can enjoy the rest of your evening now. <laughs> oh my god, I will. Well, well done again, Karen. Do you know how many entries you had on, on that one? Um, for the mini, I think two <laughs> or one or two. I really can't remember what, what, because I, I had this for the tick as well. <laughs> one pound ninety eight for a mini Cooper S worth almost twenty grand. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> <laughs> well done. Congratulations, Karen. We'll give you a phone you. tomorrow. Okay, that'll be great. Thank you. Thanks, Have a good bye. evening. <laughs> bye. 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 Ah, she was lovely. So well done, Karen from Stony. Need to far down the road. I know she was. <laughs> I think I would be as well getting that phone call. It's just amazing, isn't it? Well done, Karen. Lovely woman. Two entries, one pound ninety eight for a Mini Cooper S. Fantastic. Lovely, jubbly. So we are moving on to the Volkswagen Tiguan, which is an unexpected one for this evening. As everyone's saying, well done. That was brilliant. Was, what a reaction! It was only on for. Two days. two days, not even 48 hours. 
And you guys love a tick one, I'm sorry to say, but you absolutely it's love a tick one. It, it is, is a favourite. It is a fan favourite because it's the all-rounder. It's yes. sporty looking. It's affordable to run because it's a 1.5. It can be a family car or you don't even need to have family to yeah. drive around it because it's cool. It's the all-rounder. It's it, got a massive boot. Mm -hmm. If you've got dogs, it's handy. It's yeah. literally everything. Yeah, it's the all-in-one fan favourite, as they call it. So... Well done, everybody. So now one of you guys gets the pleasure of being the first owner of this car. It's unregistered, 2024, but I'm going to let Leanne talk you through a bit more so, about it. you all know what to do while well, I'm telling you the description of this car. Give us hell yes in the comments, please. And give us loads of loves if you're on TikTok. Tap your screen like mad. If you're on FB or YouTube, just give us a hell yeah and also give us a wheel of heart. Right. So this is the Volkswagen Tiguan R-Line. The cash alternative on this is £32,500. That's worth a lot more. Take the car. Come it on. is a 2024 brand new unregistered car. So you would be the very first owner of it, if you take the car, that is. It's got 20 delivery mileage on it, which you can't complain. It's actually 17, so oh, it's three miles oh. less than 20. <laughs> That's just it being rolled around on four courts and stuff. Um, and it's a 1.5 TSI R line. It's an automatic in dolphin grey. It's got some lovely op optional extras on there as well. So it's one to 39,000. Best of luck again, guys. Suzanne said you're losing time. Are we all clear? Can you hear us? Can you see us? Obviously, we need you to hear and see what's going on. Hell yeah, it means that we're clear as well, yeah. guys. Hell yeah stands for clear and good to go. Are we good to go, guys? Let us know and we'll hit that generate button. Make sure you're following us on TikTok as well, guys, to keep up to date with all these competitions that we've got going on because I've got some big things coming for you very, very soon. Everybody's saying clear. So, guys, Bob, good luck, everyone. Brand new go. car. Here we go. The winner of the brand new Volkswagen Tiguan is 27592. Well done. Quite a high number there this time, guys. Brand new Tiguan for what was it, two pound fifty or whatever it was? Two seven five. Get in there. Two seven five nine two. Two seven five nine two. We have Kerry Skinner. Kerry Skinner, well done. Congratulations. Two seven five nine two is Kerry Skinner. You've just went and won a brand new 2024 Volkswagen Tiguan on the 13th of the 3rd. What's the date there, Leanne? It's the 15th now, so two, two days, days ago. When it went live then. Jeez, oh, fantastic. Kerry got her entry on at 12.44, probably just about when it went live. Incredible. Sorry, Dean. I know you wanted that one, pal. But good news. We have a brand new, new shape. Because I didn't know they were bringing it even out a new shape one. 2024 uh, Volkswagen Tiguan R line in white. And apparently, we're one of the first in Scotland to get our hands on one because we pre ordered it. Hello? Hi, is that Kerry? Yeah, it is. It's Leanne and Calvin at Bounty Competitions. Are you watching the live? Uh, no, I'm not, but... <laughs> <laughs> Where are you from? Um, I'm from Inch. Inch? Ooh, well, you have just went and you have won yourself a brand new Volkswagen Tiguan. <laughs> oh, my God. I was joking. I was like, I was to my boyfriend, I was like, oh, don't be worried if you're, I've got a call from... It'll be just Bounty, but... <laughs> 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 you, do you know what? That's what you call manifestation. <laughs> I know. I was saying I was manifesting it. So, Jeez, oh, oh. Well done, Kerry. Do you know some? It's a brand spanking new car with no owners. So, Leanne has a big question here for you. So, you do have a choice to make, but I can give you overnight to think about it. You've got okay. the choice between the brand new Volkswagen Tiguan R line. It's, un, it's an unregistered car, so it's absolutely brand spanking new. Or there's a £32,500 cash alternative, but you can have overnight to think if you want. Yeah, probably. <laughs> have a think about it, but yeah. Not a problem, Kerry. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Well done. How many entries did you have on Kerry, Dina? Uh, just four. 
four entries. Brilliant. Oh, incredible. Well done. What a win. So, <laughs> thank you very much. We'll be in touch with you tomorrow, okay? Yeah, no worries. Thank Cheers. you. Cheers. Bye. Bye. Oh, lovely. Well done to Kerry. Absolutely fantastic. Brand new Volkswagen Tiguan airline. Oh. Everybody saying they're good. Fear not, my friends. We, we have, have another, another Tiguan coming. <laughs> Do you uh, just want us to try and make a big one competition? You know what? <laughs> They've always sold out fast because, again, they are the all-round family car slash cool car. Um, I did see John, was it, saying, can, we, can you do an R? Um, we, we are hoping to find uh, that they are going to be bringing the new R version out as well soon. We'll try and get our hands on one, but we can do some of the, the, the kind of newish R yeah. uh, version of them as well. They are pretty cool, them cars. So what do you do with the cars that are not taken? Good question, Stephen. They go straight to the trader. We have nothing to do with the cash alternatives. Uh, we use a trader in our local area that offers the cash alternatives. And we ask the trader, what cash alternative would you like to put on the car? It's always trade value there or thereabouts of what the car's worth as a trade-in value. But of course, we buy the cars for retail price so it's much, the, the cars are worth much more if you ask me for my opinion so um we have the audi r8 to draw there is still 33 minutes remaining on the timer and there's still entries left i have dropped a qr code into the comments for you guys over on fb um it's two pound fifty an entry there is 1309 entries remaining if you don't want to enter for the car enter for the tasty cash alternative of forty thousand pounds if you take the car, you will get £5,000 with the car, which will get you insured, get you taxed, and put some petrol in it as well. Cheers, Molly. Thanks so much. Legend. You're changing so many lives there on was a daily that basis. There someone that messaged me. Oh. I missed your call. I was putting the kids to bed. Go and ring them back, Leanne. Go on. Nine, find out who it is. We might have another winner's phone call here, guys. Oh, that was ages ago. Was oh, that? Was it maybe Louis? Ah. Uh, for the Makita bundle. Yeah. Um, yeah, it is. It's Louis. Well done, all winners, Suzanne. I'll just give him a We're going to ring Louis. Um, oh, we'll just message him. I'll message him. Louis. Yeah. Um, is the one million sold out yet? Not yet, Lisa. Let's go no. and quickly take a sneaky peek at what the million's at because you guys have been in there buying entries. Also, there's 930 left on Sydney if you want to grab an entry yeah. on that. I'll drop the link on the we'll be back comments at, for you guys. We'll be back either when the R8 sells out, which it's not looking likely, or 9 o'clock at the end of the timer. If the Sydney holiday is sold out at the same time, we'll draw the Sydney holiday as well as the Audi R8. Cheers, Leo. You're there a legend, is. buff. 25,864 remaining on the 1 million. So it's not going to get sell out entries, for tonight. Guys, get your entries. You've got our word. We'll give you what if it sells out before next Friday, which is the end of the timer, we'll give you a warning, a two hour warning, so that everybody can tune in for the big, massive 1 million pound draw, which one of you guys is going to win. Say it out loud. One of you guys is going to be a millionaire for 10 pounds. It's as simple as that. Get your entry on. And we could be ringing you just like what we've done tonight with our winners. Uh, and I'm sure to God that whoever wins that, your life will be changed forever. Cheers, Steve. You are as well, pal legend. With a surname such as mine, I'd love to win the spider. <laughs> Spiders web. <laughs> Fiona, brilliant. Love you guys, says Leo. Love you too, brother. Molly says, good on you, man. Cheers, Molly. It's been great. We couldn't do it without you guys taking part. Your participation means everything. Uh, and again, if you don't win with us, Fear not, because we do loads of cool stuff in the background with um, with the money. We, we sponsor a lot of people. We always donate back to charities. We're always donating to stuff in the background that we don't always mention as well. So the, um, it's, uh, it means a lot with everybody taking part. And thank you. The R8 has half an hour on it, so we'll come back at 9 o'clock tonight. Guys, if you're on TikTok as well, make sure you're following us on TikTok, because I have a free giveaway coming up very soon for you guys on TikTok. Once we do one on TikTok, I will do another one on FB as well. So make sure you're Stephen, watching that. Stephen, keep well. going, bud. We sponsored Stephen and John down in Whitehaven to do the Three Peaks Challenge. Uh, they're raising money for the, the kids' football kits, uh, and they're doing really well. Sam Bees is Stephen, and is a Bransty Rangers for, for John. Uh, so well done, lads. Keep smashing it. Jeez, that is absolutely insane what you guys are doing. Doing Three Peaks, the three highest peaks in England, Wales, and Scotland. And because we've sponsored them, they're sticking a bounty flag at the top of each peak. So we'll be on the highest peaks of the mountains 
all over the UK. So yes, that's pretty cool. Yes, we're tonight, nine o'clock, or as soon as it sells out. But I'm going to say we'll come back at nine o'clock yeah. so everybody knows. Okay. We'll be back at nine. We'll see you at nine, guys. Thanks, everyone, for taking part. Nine o'clock for the R8 draw. Get involved. Still loads of entries left. Right. Uh, could be you tonight.